Hey everyone, Andrew here. I'm the YouTube critic. I review games, movies, YouTubers, and TV series. So, let the hell just talk about that and later. What are you doing? What are you doing, Nora? What are you doing? <laughs> but since this is a movie review, and this is a movie called Mary and Max. Sure, this movie. Yeah, look, it, for people who saw this, they were, thought this was like some sort of stop-motion film. And in some ways, it is. But at other times, it feels like it's an animated movie. It stars a guy named Max and a little girl named Mary. What's the movie called Mary and Max? Not Max and Max. I, I don't remember. Man, it's kind of hard to remember, you know? But, while borrowing stuff with uh, her mom, Mary discovers a phone book and found Max's address. So, and he, she begins writing to him. When Max receives his letter, those letters, he begins to freak out. You may not realize soon why I'm reviewing this film. But Max composed himself and wrote back to Mary. Now, Max, you know, lives in America. I think, I forgot where uh, Mary lived. Uh, you know what this means, guys? Pulling up the Wikipedia. Wicka Wicka! Use the Wicka! Okay, here we go. Mary and Max! Oh, it was called Mary and Max. <laughs> okay, go. Okay, could be Australia. So let's see. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yep! In a city called Mount Waverly. <laughs> but Mary sent one letter that made Max freak out a lot and his brain to crack. Asking a lot of questions. And when Max decided to write back, she told he told her that he has Asperger's. So he's an Aspie. Now you see why I wanted to review this film, guys. Max has Asperger's, and I can relate to that. And he did a perfect rendition of people with Asperger's. People who take things literally. I kind of do that. Freak out over things I'm not used to, like a lot, a lot of questions. But I can handle simple questions like the ones they give you at school. But and also I can. Those are actually some forms of Asperger's. But anyway, back to the story. Mar when Mary learned about Asperger's, she began studying on Asperger's. And she managed to, well, try to find a way to make a cure and use Max as an example. And you wouldn't believe how mad Max was. She was, he was so mad, he ripped the M from his typewriter. This took place during the, like, um, early 1900s. Oh, wait, 1976. And, fair warning, this is based on a true story. When those years have gone by, Mary has learned to love. Max has grown bigger. Max, Mary got married. Uh, not Max, but he's a bit old. Uh, he's way older than Mary. And Max has grown bigger. Mary w went through a divorce. Max got a bit loco. And when Mary was uh, about to kill herself, that's why she was about to commit suicide. How many films try to do attempted suicide? Especially animated ones! 
Mary's neighbor, who lived across the street from her her whole life, managed to save the day and show and gave Mary the package that Max had sent her. And then a couple of months later, Mary went to New York City to meet Max. But unfortunately, when she arrived, he was dead. Died by obesity or probably heart attack or something. I mean, this guy ate a lot of chocolate. And sure chocolate can be healthy a bit. It's not all healthy. But Mary was glad to finally meet Max. Which I actually found pretty adorable. Actually shedded some tears at the end. And my hand was shaking. Well, after watching it, I was like, oh my god, that movie was so beautiful. I'm tearing up here, guys! I'm tearing up! Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's up with things that are based on true stories? Just give that big impact on your heart! I mean... Dora, hug me! <laughs> okay, I think I'm I'm cool enough now to give the review about the score. I give Mary and Max a five out of five. Yeah, this movie deserves that. It's so beautiful. Talking about everything people might have to go through, whether death of the parents. Yes, that did ha does happen in the story, or handling Asperger's, or even major breakdowns, and attempted suicide. That's just. Ugh. But anyway, guys. Till then, subscribe to me, follow me on Twitter, and check out these five videos right beside me. Till then, guys. See ya.